Despite everything, they're still kind people. I find that hard to believe. Because they stole Raphael away from us. They just left us with poor Donatello, Sophia, and Leonardo. I liked Raphael, the little raccoon one. <laughs> if you don't remember that, uh, go back, check it out. I know, if it's, I know it's been a while. Uh, but yeah, we had four cubs and we're looking... Wait a second. Is the scavenger still chilling there? Doing the stuff the scavenger should not be doing, which is shooting at things? Why? How are they still there? Because now that the forest has been cleared out, should they not have moved on? I don't know, maybe not. I guess I'm gonna find out pretty quick. I still don't see the scavenger. Unless they're in their hut. Which, I guess technically there is good people. Because, was it not the scavenger's daughter, or whomever? Yeah, this one! Hi! Hi! <laughs> I smell you. Can you give us good food? Oh, yeah! The little ones are gonna uh, just absolutely adore that. Pets? Yes! We got pets! <laughs> there are good people after all. Aww. Hi! Thank you! I appreciate you not trying to devour us or shoot us with your gun or anything else that your parent, grandparent, uncle, crazy uncle, maybe. Sometimes, oh, yeah, <laughs> actually, let's go in here, grab these, pop out. I'm going to carry this with me. This is a free snack that just kind of goes with me. Why is the collector, I know they're called the scavenger, but why is the collector over there? I started calling them the Collector. I want to call them the Collector. Okay, fine. I'll call them the Scavenger. Why is the Scavenger still here? It doesn't make sense. Whoa, the more I just kind of find food and head back to my den, the more of this area that gets cleared out. I feel like there are very specific spots I need to kind of check. So I'm going to go check those. Oh, two of them are right next to the scavenger, but they're this side of the scavenger. So if I go this way, hopefully I can avoid those. No! The badgers! The stupid badgers! I need to help them. You get in there, get this food, and then I'm going to go help the stupid badgers because they're dumb and they don't know what they're doing. Can I jump up there? I can't jump up there. Okay, I got this. Mama badger, can you take a look at mine? cubs for a second while I run around and get yours. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Hang on. I wish I could leave mine with them. Oh. Go. Go quickly. Quickly, but not too quickly, because if I move too fast, they will definitely absolutely see us. Now, come here, stupid badger. Yeah. There you go. And now, I can just... Oh, you're in the way. Why are you in the way? Now I have to take yours and come all the way back around? You know, I'm risking my life, my limb, for these stupid badgers. All they've been is a pain. Although, I guess the badgers are kind of just the same as me. Just kind of out here, looking and trying to be safe. Because they're getting deforested the same as we are. Oh no, daytime's upon us. Winter is coming. <laughs> I, I need to... Run! Yeah! Big dummy. I'm so close. So close. No. No. Look the other way. Good. Yeah! Look at us saving stupid badgers. Here you go! Oh. I do feel bad because they got hurt. Hopefully you'll be okay together. Are you okay together? You probably don't want to sleep right there. If I were you, I would find a den. Not mine, though. Definitely not my den. No! The fur is behind us, huh? They are, actually. What do I do? What do I do? I guess I go off to the right. Stupid badgers, be okay, okay? Stupid badgers, will you be okay? They're gonna look away, and then I'm gonna go. I have to go this way, and I have to go around. And I have to go quickly now. Jump! Yes! Good! I was able to get around 
the scavenger. Now, how do I get back, though? This way's difficult, especially with the furrier there. Hmm. And they know where we are. They can basically see us. They're just not very good shot with the gun, so they can't hit us. They're going to stay away from stupid badgers, too, which is good because I just risked my life. Even if they are stupid badgers and I don't care much about them, I care enough because I did a thing. I just want everything to be happy that I do. Everyone else, I know everyone else is just trying to get by, too, in this harsh world, but everyone else can screw off. It's all about me and what I'm doing. <laughs> That's how you, it always is in games. It's whatever you're doing at that moment is the most important. And that's how I feel about these adorable foxes. You can fast travel between areas using the badger's dens now because they love us. See? I knew saving stupid badgers would be good. Now they're not so stupid anymore. There's another smell. Raphael is near. You hear that? Leonardo? Donatello? Your brother is around. Sophia? I know you didn't like them very much, but... Honestly, nobody else did. Actually, no, that's the raccoon one. What am I talking about? It's Donatello that nobody liked. Raphael's the good one. <laughs> no! And it's kind of fitting. Someone suggested in the comments I should name them after the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and it's so fitting. No! Seriously, why just... If you can't sell it, put Raphael down! Let Mama Fox take care of them. Oh. The little girl's trying to save Raphael. I love the little girl dearly. Let me guess. Oh, no, I don't have to go in there. That's actually good for me. I'm not ready to explore the farm yet. There are so many awesome scents around here, though, to explore. Have I been to that house in the back? No, that's where I'm probably going next. A reward, a fox pelt reward? Is that what that's saying? It's not big enough. It's not worth the reward. I'm kind of upset now. Because that means that... Is there no way to save poor Raphael? Period. There is no w way for me to get them back to safety. I'm just walking into the trap already set by the scavenger. I hope not. Ah! Ah! No! I forgot about it! Ah! Run! Go. We'll be okay. Come on. I just got to keep moving. The furrier's behind us. We just got to go. There's someone coming from in front of us? Who? Oh, there's a person right there. I feel like I might be able to sprint by them, but I got to be careful about that. Because I've done it once before, but it's really risky because I might lose one of the cubs if we do it too many times. Oh, no. We might not have a choice. I'm going to risk it. Let's sprint by this one. Come on, little ones. Go this way. We got to get back to the badger hut. Badgers, I need in. Badgers, no. Urgh, bite it. Bite him, bite him, bite him, bite him, bite him. Yeah, get out of here. B badgers, let me. Okay, screw it, I guess. No badgers. Just run. Careful, badgers. Badgers, maul the furrier, please. Oh, stupid badgers. I need you down more than ever. What I definitely need to do, though, is explore this area. This seems like a very important spot where there's going to be a lot of interactables and probably a lot of people, too. Oh. What the... I mean, I could sneak up and get the... Ch okay, let's sneak up and get the chicken. Chickens are not the most intelligent things. <laughs> We've raised chickens before, so I know that chickens are not exactly the smartest of the animal kingdom, but it still feels bad. Oh! Oh my god, there's a machine that just, their heads go in, their heads come out the other side, separated from their bodies. Oh, that's gruesome. That's probably better than what I was picturing about, like, how do they harvest chickens, but... <laughs> Is that a, a little chick grinder, or... Uh, okay. I guess that's where the chicken nuggets come from. 
<laughs> That's... That seems horrible. Why would... That seems like a waste. Why wouldn't you let them grow up to at least full grown? You get a lot more out of it that way. Ah! No! Grab the chicken. Or... I guess you guys can eat up. Oh, they were stealing chicken because they're starving. Ah, that makes total sense now. This whole area is probably starving. There is so much going on. I am so far away from my den. I don't have a prayer of getting back anytime soon. So I guess we're out for the day. Maybe I risk it. Do I risk it for the biscuit or risk it for Raphael skit, I guess? <laughs> go, go get that food. We're going to need it if we're going to be out during the day. Can I push? Why? There we go. It's weird sometimes. You have to be in like the right spot in order to get anything. Meat is the best. Whatever canned meat that is, whether it's cow or chicken or raccoon, um, whatever it is. It's delicious, and it fills us right up. Just as long as it's not Raphael meat, that's all I care about. <laughs> Just chilling? Oh, there's another fox there. Hmm, I'm sorry. Oh, oops. Uh, my bad. You were kind of already gone anyway, so... I guess I can sort of justify it. No! Run! 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 We're fine. Just run. They can't get us over here. Actually, wait. I can't go that way. I gotta go this way. This is the way I must go. Run, 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 run. Grab that. Grab it. No. Run! Run, run, run. <laughs> I don't know if it makes me heavy or not, but I'm taking this home. Oh, they can't get through. Dummy. There, eat this. We're going to be fine. We're going to be fueled up by the time you're done eating. Oh, I got some scars. Those are definitely going to scar. Nasty cuts on our side. Oh, well, I guess uh, that's all part of nature. I have never felt so far away from my den. There are... There's like six different ways I could go to get there, and all of them feel like there is someone there waiting for me. Oh, there's another purple scent. Good thing I checked. Everyone, this way. It, there's a purple scent leading me over to where the scavenger used to be. They're not there anymore with their gun on top of the rock. P probably got kicked out by all of the loggers who were cutting down and deforesting the entire woods. Oh. They still have Raphael. They didn't sell them to the forester or the furrer. I'm sorry, I got foresters on the mind right now. I don't know why. Probably because I'm still in awe of how quickly they just demolished that forest. Oh my god, I need to eat. Luckily, there's food nearby. Right here, little one. Right here. It's okay. Mama's got you. You're okay. <laughs> just make sure that one gets the majority of the food, okay? Share! Oh, there's purple up there. But I need to go get more food before I find more of the purple. Great. <laughs> it's probably going to be a plastic bag. No! Actually, for once, it has been nice to me. Oh, it's being really nice. That's not good. Yep, that's what I thought. I can never get more than two. And I've only ever had one trash bag not put a bag on my head. That was such a good day. <laughs> now it's not. Oh, this is going to be my next hut. is Er, den, isn't it? I bet you. She's sick. They're holding on to Raphael. I think because they're not bad people. I think they think that it, they're all by themselves. And that if they hold on to them... Then no one will, like, her. The badgers are here! Oh, <laughs> Yeah! The stupid badgers. Oh, they're no longer stupid. I love them dearly. They can stay with us. This den's plenty big enough. But, like I was saying, it seems like 
The daughter is sick. The scavenger is just trying to find enough money and pelts and things in order to like get the medicine that's needed in order to heal the daughter. Whatever she's got. And as much as I think I might be wrong. They might have just taken Raphael as a pet for the daughter to make the daughter feel better because they're so sick. Which I can understand that. <laughs> but please... <laughs> Wild animals are not pets. Don't do that. But this is different. This is like a different experience. This is a different world. This is different life that they're going through. They probably don't have options to go and find regular pets. So a little fox cub makes sense. I kind of understand where they're coming from. I also... Maybe they thought that the only way the cub could ever have a decent life if it was by itself... You know, since Mama Fox wasn't there, like, chomping at the end of the den, they probably assumed, oh, this is just a little cub then, all by its lonesome. Would be if they took care of it, because this world is cruel to wild animals. But that also doesn't excuse them, besides the fact that they need money, for why they're trying to shoot Mama Fox. And I hate the fact that we now have scars on our side. Looks like going to be permanent. I don't know. We'll see if they heal in the next episode. So thank you so much for watching this one. And remember to take care. And goodbye!